Hello guys and welcome back to Natural Remedies. I'm here once again to bring back some more common sense into the world. In this brief video, I'm going to explain to you that why you shouldn't drink 8 glasses of water in a day. Let's begin. Firstly, the notion that our bodies are made up of 70% water is actually false. Yep, because it's not just pure water, it's actually the electrolytes inside your body. When you are drinking a lot of water in a day, more than 8 glasses, you are actually harming your body if you aren't also replenishing the electrolytes that you lose while doing this. For example, as you can see in this picture, some of the main fluids inside our bodies that need to be replenished daily are number 1. Sodium. You can get that from salt and basically almost every other food will contain some sodium so I don't think many people will need to actively work to replenish sodium in their bodies. Number 2 is chloride and you can get that from tomatoes, leafy greens, olives and seaweeds. Number 3 is magnesium and you can get that from dark leafy greens, spinach, spearmint, broccoli, almonds, cashews, um, avocados, apples and even bananas contain some magnesium. Number 4 is calcium. Now everyone knows this but I'll still tell you guys the best sources to get calcium are milk, cheese, yogurt and even some dark leafy greens like kale, spinach and broccoli. Number 5 is potassium or potassium however you want to call it. The best way to get more potassium into your diet is to eat bananas and boiled potatoes with their skin on. A single banana contains 350 to 450 milligrams of potassium and a single medium potato contains 600 milligrams of potassium. If you remove the skin then you lose 150 milligrams of potassium from the potatoes. You can also have sweet potatoes since they also contain around 400 milligrams of potassium in a single sweet potato. The reason why I am telling you guys the amount of potassium these foods contain is because an adult needs around 3000 to 4000 milligrams of potassium in a day. Okay, so these are some of the main fluids and electrolytes that you need to replenish for the proper functioning of your body. Uh, and now, since you know all of this, the people who drink the most water and fess about it are actually some of the most dehydrated people I've ever seen. And that's because they keep flushing out all the electrolytes. And if you keep dehydrating yourself by drinking just pure water, you better watch out because you can actually die from it. Yes, it's a real condition called hyponatremia. You can look it up if you want. So what is my purpose in making this video? The purpose is to teach people and to let people know that the goal is not to just drink 8 glasses of pure water every day, but to eat a balanced diet that will help you feel good and live good. Out of all the foods I have mentioned in this video, if you eat any 3 of them in a day, then I would say that you are on the safe side. You also might have a question that how much water should you even drink then? And the answer is pretty simple. You only need to drink water when you feel thirsty or when your pee gets darker than yellow. For most people that would be about 3 to 4 glasses in a day. But you have to keep track of that by yourself for the next few days until it becomes second nature to you. Do not listen to anything else someone might say about this. There is a lot of misinformation out there. Be careful and trust only me. That's it for this video guys. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe and share this video with your friends and family too. Goodbye and take care.